And good evening, everyone. Time to get the uh, Independence Day stream off the ground here. A little 4th of July action going for some freedom and zombies. I apologize, but I've already eaten all the barbecue, so I have none left for anyone else. But we're just going to have to make do with roast zombies. Uh, in the last uh, chapter of Walking Dead Michonne, I think we, let's see, we escaped from the floating city, made our way to uh, what's-her-name's house, dad got blown away, and the bad guy showed up, taunted us a little bit, and then we bashed his skull in. We could have taken the high road, but we chose not to because we're just sick of the guy. So we beat his head in, and now we're done with it. And we'll probably get all of that in our uh, recap of the stream. Oh, Nia, thank you very much for the bits. Happy 4th of July. I realize it's not uh, Irish Independence Day, but it is still July 4th. Though I guess technically it's the 5th of July there now, but still. Thank you for the bits. I really appreciate it. I don't know what happened to the alert. Maybe it's the uh, football alert that it Streamlabs freaked out about it. Oh, pizza sounds good. But I had barbecue. And as good as pizza is, barbecue... Barbecue is barbecue, and it, it kind of trumps pizza every now and then. And barbecue pizza just doesn't cut it. we got to stay with real barbecue. But I've had barbecue, and I'm, I'm good for a few months now. Probably more than a few months. And I'll have to wait until tomorrow before I'm like in the mood for any kind of pizza. So, let's uh, move on. Chapter 3. Now that we've killed the guy, we're going to get what we deserve. This is the final chapter of Michonne. It's a short... Well, shorter than the others. They've all been five chapters. And they've all been about two hours, and these have all run about an hour and a half, so that's a little disappointing, too. Previously... On the Walking Dead Michonne. No! Hey! See, this could have all be been over there. before the first. Your brother. Or before the opening credits ran. I'm not leaving you behind. You start butchering their people, and our chances of making it out of here, any of us, go down to zero. Unless we butcher enough of them. They, they had some supplies just sitting out and Norma caught me. I didn't think she was going to, but she, she, she let me go. Michonne, what is it? That's why you don't leave the gate open. What kind of dumbass are you? Ah. I'm tired of his shit.
He deserved it. hoping we'd made it back to the boat. If this ends without knowing what happened to the people on the boat, I'm going to be pissed. Hope you're not thinking about jumping. Because if you do, I'm going to have to come in after you. I'm not looking forward to that. Water's going to be an ice bowl. No one wants to see that, Oak. Yeah, I know. Ooh. I like Freeze this guy. My ass off. Here. Yeah. Coffee will warm you up. Go on. <laughs> God damn, Oak. You can't call it coffee when more than half's whiskey. Uh, you sound like my ex-wife. She was more of a rum girl. Hey, City! Did you hear the one about the kittens who took over the boat? What? They tell me I can't call it coffee if more than half of it is milk and sugar, too. That's the only way I'm gonna drink it. I despised a lot of them when I first got on board. But they grow on you. Like mold, they are. Nah, nah, sorry, that shit, isn't it? They're growing on me, too. Kinda nice that people can still joke around. It's a fine line between the court jester and the village idiot. You can guess which side I think he's on. I have managed to erase that line. Before I joined up with Pete, my brother and I were cooped up in an old canning factory. Food for ages. A lot of fat and happy people. But then... A young girl got... taken. We followed her trail. It wasn't hard with all the blood. Ended up cornering the people who took her... in this warehouse. All ten of us went in. Only I came out. You did the right thing. And it got my brother killed. The right thing can kiss my ass. A few weeks later, I came across Pete, a ways up the coast. He saw that look on my face and he offered me a job. Didn't ask any questions, didn't turn me away. Just welcomed me in. I don't always get Pete, but I'm glad people like him still exist. I'll drink to that. Well, I think Berto's little routine is winding down so we can finally play cards. Care to join us? It'd be nice to have you there. Besides, none of us can remember the rules. Yeah. Do me in. Sounds like a challenge. You might regret it when I win that machete of yours. What's gonna happen when the world's supply of booze finally runs out? Are you sure you want to be there? I need to see him. I need to see that bastard's face. <laughs> Spit on him. Oh, God. He's dead. I should have stopped you. How could you do this? That man was tied up. Defenseless. He got what he deserved. I knew I shouldn't have left you alone with him. I wanted this. I, I did, but 
Seeing him now? Well, yeah, but you gotta fight the zombies to grow it. I wish I'd been the one to Harvest do it. Harvest it. Sam. It was my dad. My family. You're not a killer, Sam. Don't become one. You don't know what I am. Uh! Sam, calm down. My dad isn't even in the fucking then, I mean, ground yet, and you, you want know, me you're, to calm you're down? You're gonna wanna age it. I, I didn't mean he ruined everything. He killed. And I know. Aging I know. it in a world full of zombies yeah. is gonna be kind of tough. You hear that? Answer me now. Well, it's time for a reckoning. Michonne. You don't want to keep me waiting. I'm right here. Good. You might be sitting pretty thinking you have the upper hand, but your luck has changed. Michelle and Sadiq. They got the rest of the crew too. Oak and Berto. Look, whatever this bitch asks, don't... Sadiq! Don't worry. They're all in good hands well, here. You could always make them extra that way and light the zombies on so fire. So you can get drunk and have a bonfire. My brother for your friends. But anything you do to Randall, I will do to them. Do you understand? Look, you don't owe me anything, but please. We have to get them back. That goes both ways. Anything you do to my friends, I'll do to Randall. You better not touch him! We'll be there by sunrise. Too be late. Ready for us. I've already touched him. Touched him a little hard. Alright, the game just freeze? What's going on? Hey, Dave. Well, enjoy your barbecue. I've already had mine for the day, and it was delicious. Shit. All right, now we can use him as a zombie to... Uh, He'll at least be moving around. We can, we can, uh, he'll at least look like he's still alive. I hate that this song causes Twitch to mute my bot. I know, it's, I really like it. I guess it's a good thing I didn't shoot him in the head. She's coming here for her brother. When she sees what we did to him. Problem solved. Good At thinking. At least he can walk, right? If you can call that walking. Let's just hope she doesn't take it out on my guys. We just need to fool Norma long enough to get our friends back. Then what? You know, we, uh... Norma's not gonna leave loose. us alone. 
We turn she him loose in their camp. Just because we gave her her brother back. Even if he was alive, we still burned all their shit. So we run. After you trade for your friends, we haul ass to the back gate and get the hell out of here. But she'd take the house. Let her have it. Wouldn't she expect us to run? So what? She knows where we are now. It's not gonna be that easy, Paige. If we run, they'll chase us. But maybe we get away. If we stay here, there's no chance we get out of this alive. I can't fucking listen to this. <laughs> Sam, come back here. Sam! Sam, what the hell are you doing? God damn it. Sam, stop. Maybe you're all ready to walk away, but I'm not just going to leave him like this. He's dead. He doesn't live here anymore. We couldn't give my mom a real funeral. My dad and I... I had to bury her here. Just the two of us. He'd want to be with her. That's all I can give him. I understand. You should be buried with your mom. But we can't focus on that right now. We have to be ready to leave. I'm not going. What? Sam, you can't still be thinking My that... mom is here, Paige. Everything I have of her. And Greg. If you want to leave, go ahead, but I'm not coming with you. I really hate stupidly sentimental people in these kinds of stories. I'm sorry. But I, I can't go. This house meant everything to my dad. It's all I have left. I know you don't want to. But leaving might be your only option. It isn't safe here anymore. I know, but I, I can't just give up. We can fight. We can defend this house. No matter what happens, thank you. I owe you my life. Sorry it took me so long to say it. So you're just going to throw it away now? I know it's stupid, yes. but I have to finish this. I've got some weapons stashed in my room. Old duffel bag. Should look familiar. You should make sure everyone's armed before Norma gets here. I was just wanted to know what it felt like. I, I wasn't gonna shoot it. Just careful. You don't want to shoot yourself. Empty. We live in a world full of zombies, and we're about to be run, overrun by a bunch of people that are coming to kill us. You may as well learn how Can to I shoot, help? kid. I want to do something. Sure, go ahead. Those slide in there. Round side forward. Oh, 
how did they just die like that? Hey, Greg and Dad. I, I thought we were safe here. What am I supposed to do? You have to be smart. That's how you survive. My dad was Stand the smartest around, guy I knew. Open. That didn't save him. The guy who did it killed my dad. He's gotta, I mean, the things he said, the way he was laughing about dad. Randall is dead, James. I killed him. I heard you guys talking. There's more people coming to the house. Sam's hurt. If, if she, they can't hurt her too. You have to stop them. Your sister's tough. I wouldn't worry about her too much. Here. I, I don't know if I'm ready, you know, to have one. Take this to your sister. Norma's on her way. Things could go wrong in a hurry. You mean more wrong than they already have? Wish it didn't always come to this. Well, come on, we live in a world hey, full of zombies. Hey, what's hold up? It always comes to this. What do you want to do? Yeah, we don't have time for this. Get him moving. Is that music? Flashbacks are really inconvenient. Can I come in? Thought this was the kid's room for a second. You doing okay in here? I bet that was scary before when I brought your sister in like that. But she's okay now. Nothing can hurt me in here. As long as I stay in my fortress, I'm safe. It keeps all the bad stuff out. I put pillows and blankets against the wall. Looks pretty sturdy. I bet it's kept you nice and safe for a long time. That's good. It has to. Because of them. I know what those monsters out there are. One to go. Grandma told me about them. It's what happens when someone eats another person. Oh? I hadn't heard that one before. Do they scare you too? They make lots of noise. Even at night. Getting scared is normal. Really? Happens to everyone sometimes. But my dad's not scared of them. I've been waiting for him. Where is he? Why He's not didn't coming he come back, get kid. me yet? Where's my dad? I'm so sorry, Alex. Something terrible happened. A bad man came and hurt your dad. What? He shot him. No! I don't believe you! I want to see him. Please. Sometimes awful things happen. <laughs> and there's nothing we can do about it. Did my dad be become one of them? It it it's what happens, right? No. 
He was shot in the head. When someone dies, you put a bullet or something sharp right here. <laughs> and then they don't turn. Okay? It's not fair. Alex, you need to be strong. Okay? I can't. Hey, keep the chatter to a minimum. Our friends are listening. <laughs> That's the ones that are still alive. You really got to be careful of. It's in here. Just came out of there. James Fairbanks. Alex Fairbanks. Greg. I mean, he had pretty good artwork going until he made the guy's face a square. I remember getting my law degree. Doesn't mean much now. Sue Norma. John, take care of our children and take care of yourself. I'm sorry. I know that doesn't help or explain anything, but it's true. I can't stand watching you and the kids suffer, knowing what's going to happen to me and what I'll become. Better to spare you that pain. I love you more than anything. Sophie. It's technically it is a dear John. Though. They look really happy together. All right, you kids. I said no running in the house. Just the room I was just in. Yeah. Well, let's talk to her before I give her ammo. Oh, hey, she may I, not I want to talk after in. she's armed. Were you able to talk some sense into her? Or do you still think digging a hole is a good use of Sam's time? I've never seen her like this. She's she's not thinking. Give her some space, okay? She's grieving. I know. And I wish I could give her that, but Norma's not gonna wait for her to get over her dad's death. The shitstorm's coming whether we're ready for it or not. I don't know why Sam thinks she can protect her brothers here. I'll be out of your hair soon enough. Never belonged here anyway. Same as you. That's one thing we got in common. Squatters in other people's lives. What do you mean, same as me? I know what it's like running from whatever. I spent most of my life doing that. Norma's gonna be here soon. If they're not ready, I won't stick around just to watch this fall apart. She's so stubborn, though. I just hope it doesn't get her killed this time. You're the only one here who can convince Sam to leave. Talk to her. I tried. Try again. She needs to be ready to run. 
And so do the kids. The Fairbanks kept me safe, but I don't know if I can do the same for them. Here. We'll shoot her in the arm and tell her to get off her ass and get moving. Where was Pete? He was in the garage last I saw him. I'm sure he's not still there. Kitchen. Alex must have drawn this one. I hope he's okay. Sam's room and see what she's hiding. Wow. She's been all over the world. Those days are long gone now. Right behind you. Walker. Sam's passport. This must be her mother. Sophia Fairbanks. Almost out of space in these. Sam's mom wrote this. Took Sam to see the Eiffel Tower. I don't think she cared much for it, but we found a little shop on the way back and ate about 50 macarons each. I blame the pregnancy. Sam blames our shared sweet tooth. At least Sam has some happy memories to hold on to. Well, they're not going to last. Here. It's probably in the garage. Or maybe not. This must be how they reinforce the gate. Hope it keeps Norma out. Well, we keep a lot of things out. If you didn't leave it open. Nearly empty. What a mess. Ugh. Better than I thought. <sighs> hey, Tizzy. Hey, Sam. Hey. Thanks for before. I, uh, I couldn't have moved it myself. Something you need? I ran into James inside. There's she an, go uh, talk to him. I, uh, overlay I know. now that I, you can use to pick your avatar. I know nothing I say is going to make it any better. Paige thinks we're not safe here. Now we need to move on. But she's trying to convince you to leave, too. She's wanted out of here for a while. I'm not leaving without you. I wouldn't blame you if you did. You're here to get your people back, and that's fine. None of this is your mess. It's just so much of this place is my dad. It's all of us. He worked his way up from nothing, took a job cleaning houses, paid his way through law school. When he bought this house, it was, it was proof that he'd made a better life for us. We grew up here. I, maybe I'm crazy, but I can't let that all be for nothing. He was so proud of what he built. This place kept us safe. We were happy here. 
Norma doesn't care about any of that. She's coming here, and she's not going to stop just because this place has sentimental value. I know. I don't expect you to understand. I should get back to I work. I understand. It's you that doesn't understand. Is Pete. to the kitchen that goes outside don't have anything worth stealing. James and Alex, wonder how they'll get through all this. Old record player. Nah, I don't want to hear it. In my luck, it'll just start some music and it'll get my VOD muted again. Gonna be able to look at that the same way again. Of course, I could heat that up and use it to get Sam to get a move on. Yeah, I can keep seeing things right as I walk out. I like the way Pete just stands around as I'm wandering through. This is a mess. Can't believe how fucking stupid I was. I get so focused on finding people. I wasn't putting the crew first. I didn't insist on looking. If I didn't turn us around and lead us here. It's not your fault, Pete. You didn't know this would happen. Oak knew. I should have fucking listened. Yes. I think after all this time, after... Everything we've had to do to survive, people would want to help each other. But no, they're just guarding bastards. what's theirs and taking out whoever gets in their way. Bastard I don't know why bastards trying to help bastard Philip. Doesn't, doesn't seem worth it. Maybe I was just fooling myself. I wanted to think there were people worth helping. This isn't you, Pete. You help people. You helped me. Don't give up. I won't. We just... We have to get my crew back. Hopefully my boat is still in one piece. Shit. What the hell are we gonna do? What happens after we hand him over? If she takes that bag off... We're gonna have to fight. I trust you. Or we could just abandon the crew and start over with these kids. Let's give him a gun. Here, Pete. Almost forgot what I came for. Thanks. It's just outside to give Sam a gun. Sam's mom. This. Looks like she was pretty sick. Michonne, I'm uh, looking for Alex. Have you seen him? I want him to be there when I say a few words for Dad. He wasn't at Mom's funeral. He should be there for this. He's hiding in his closet. Thanks. I'll go get him. 
I'll meet you outside. Kids, let's move it. Time's wasting. Why am I here? Sam? I barely knew the man. You okay? Greg and Dad? I just... I don't really know what to say. Where am I supposed to start? Just say what he meant to you. Yeah. Okay. I'll give you a moment. Hey, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Michonne. Just thinking about my kids. I keep seeing them. Hang in there. We'll be back out on the water soon. You know I envy them a little. They've managed to hold on to something we all lost a long time ago. Something like normal. I don't know how to describe it. Feels like before. Just a little bit. It may seem nice, but it won't keep them alive. They don't know how to survive out there. Hey, it's gonna be tough leaving this place. I just hope I can convince Sam to go with me. Michelle? She's here! <sighs> I thought we had more time. It's okay. It's gonna be okay. Sam! Just go upstairs with your brother, okay? I need you to hide until I come get you. <sighs> What's gonna happen? He gonna hurt us? Yes. Y you'll Very stop much them, so. right? Stay out of sight and you'll be safe. Norma's not after you. Everything will be fine. Stay together, no matter what. We will. Okay. I can get a clear shot of the front gate from upstairs. I'll cover you. If I can. I hope it doesn't come to that. Are you sure? Not really. Paige, if anything goes wrong, I need you to take care of James and Don't Alex. Don't talk like that. Paige, please. Sam, you know I'll... Grab Randall and meet us outside. And for the love of God, don't take off the the uh, bag.
Maybe she should do it's a better job of hiding upstairs. You ready for this? Anything goes wrong out there, I got your back. We just have to be careful not to provoke her. I don't want this to turn into a fight. Hopefully Norma feels that way too. It's just me. What the hell is going on here? I had my people hang back a bit. I wanted to talk first. Just us. Clear the air a little. What's your game? No game. I just want to talk. Where's Pete's crew? They're not far. Don't worry. Why should we believe you? I may be a lot of things, but I'm no liar. Your crew is safe, I promise you. Listen, Monroe is gone. Sunk down in the water like everything I built. You and I, we've each taken from the other. All I want now is my brother back. That's all. And I'll leave you be. You'll get Randall after you hand over my friends. After everything you've done, you expect me to simply hand over your friends, just you like You started that. it. Careful, Michonne. A show of good faith, then. Any minute now. Safe and sound, just like I said. Now, I want to see my brother. Why the hell are we standing here? We're all homeless because of her. Getty, stop! They should be dead! That is not what we are here for. Now be quiet! My brother, now. I have given you what you wanted. I just want to see him. He's right here. <laughs> Randall, you okay? <sighs> Just hang on. I got gotcha. you. You better hope when I take that mask off, he don't look as bad as he sounds. Release that one. It's okay. We just need this to be over. Let him go, Gabby. Glad you're safe, man. I made good on my end. Now it's your turn. <laughs> Give me Randall. Oak! Hey, put the gun down. I could shoot him and still have one more to spare. So you're gonna do what I've asked. Now! I came here willing to talk. But if you're gonna insist on being difficult... Don't hurt him, all right? Randall! <laughs> you wanna try that again? Randall isn't worth all this shit. Gabby, listen to After me. After everything they've done, you're still giving them more chances. We deserve retribution. Don't do this! Stop! No! No! <laughs> Virgil! Everyone put your guns uh, down! I knew we couldn't trust them! Don't! Stand down! Please, don't hurt him. If you're not gonna do anything, we have to. That's not your call. You better get your people under control. <laughs> Gabby! Fuck! <clears throat> I'll give you that one, all right? We're even. As long as you let Randall go. Uh. 
I'm not gonna ask you again. No one else has to die. Is that a threat? It doesn't need to be. I want Oak on his way over. He starts walking, and I'll send Randall out. Maybe you didn't hear me. Ah! Oak! No. Ah! Oak! Please, get up. your ass, Norma. Stay down! Get the rest of them! Burn the whole fucking house down! Come on, I'm pressing Q. Surprisingly, it did not taste like chicken. Zachary! No. Leave her alone! She did it! Zach! What the? Zombies gotta eat, too. Besides, you killed my boy, Oak. Well, this loading screen's taking forever. Say loading screen, it's a loading swirly thing. Well, let's at least have a little music while we wait. Decided to crash here. 
surely it hasn't, because the thing is still turning. I'm thinking it may have. You know, it locked up on me earlier, but it finally started up again. And every now and then the thing freezes like it's thinking and then starts again, so... There it goes. And I died because I had my hands off the keyboard trying to deal with the problem and got caught off guard. So I'm blaming this one on the game. That death doesn't count. You didn't see that happen. That was like alternate reality or something. We gotta hold the door with something. I thought you weren't gonna make it for a minute. They stopped firing. Surrounding the house. We have to get out of here. Where are the boys? Upstairs. Alex, James, hurry Why up. Why are we yelling? to escape the burning apartment. Press X to not die. Come in unless they were invited. No, that's vampires. Never mind. to cough.
you out of here. It's not safe. Phone call. I'll get back to you girls in Michelle, a second. it's Dominic. What's Where the hell are you? Go pack your things, okay? We have to go. Where's mommy? We tried to wait. We're, we're, we're heading to Donna. Dad. She'll, she'll be fine. Come on. No, she'll come look for us. We have to be here. Michonne, if you're still... Just stay safe, okay? They need you. I did look for you. I came back. I promise. It was just too late. You were already zombies. that quick time event because I stopped to take a drink of water. It's always at the most inconvenient times. I have seen them. Sam, we have to go. Yeah, you're right. Come on. We can get out through Craig's room. Follow me. Stay right with me, okay? okay. Go. <coughs> <coughs> They do have faces. James! Don't go. This isn't goodbye. I'll see you again. When? I don't know. Soon. Say goodbye, girls. Your mother has to leave. Leave, Mama? Stay here. With us. She can't. Just let her go. Dominic, please. Just let me say goodbye. Come on, Alex. What are you doing? <coughs> no. Girls, enough. Let her leave if that's what she wants. Michelle! Colette, she can't stay. We can't stay here! It's too late. Girls, listen to me. I have to go. I, I just have to go. Sorry. 
seems to me that Michonne talks a big game and then... Where the hell is my mouse? There it is. And then she's just a little bit insane and can't follow her own advice. I was thinking maybe it's my internet where it's trying to do a cloud save and can't connect, but I've I've dropped a total of 84 frames this entire stream, so it can't be that. And then even then, cloud save should just give an error and move on. Sadiq's going to take a boat down to what's left of Monroe. Salvage what we can. We can drop you off in Oceanside or maybe one of the other communities up north. Good people. Thanks. And thank you for everything. I don't know if we would have made it out of there without you. You found my brothers. You took care of Norma. We owe you a lot. Promise me you'll learn from this. Remember what happened here. I will and how it's ultimately all your fault. It'll be harder out there without old Kimberto. I need to lean on you a bit more. It's not going to be the same without them. I'm going to miss them too. I know this has been hard on you. There's Not that much, but more. they've kind of grown up. When we got separated, I heard you calling for your daughters. What happened in there? I tried to find you, but I couldn't. I had to get everyone out and... I wasn't thinking clearly. All the smoke... saw things that couldn't be real. It's happening more often now. The hallucinations, hearing things. Maybe you'd better start thinking about, you know, what if this doesn't go away? Maybe it won't. But this time, when I saw them, I was able to walk away. Couldn't keep living in that moment with them anymore. I think it's time to stop running. Go back to your group, the people you left, your family, before you can't anymore. If I know anything, it's how goddamn impermanent things are these days. You trying to get rid of me? Ah, uh, you caught me. Come on.
Well, at least we know the hallucinations aren't over. Ah, my little one. This is how it's done. You play your part, and I'll play mine. Ah, my little one. This is how it's done. You play your part. And I'll play mine But your love drags me down Like the clothes when you swim And another song to get my vibe muted. Excellent. Down deeper down Like the roots of old trees It's like these episodes keep getting shorter my heart and shorter. Has no home. This should have really been in just two parts. Me to the bones. The first one was an hour and a half, and they've been shorter and shorter after that. It'll be just so let's see, how'd we do? Let Sam bury her father. Most people let her do it. I think that's fair. Ah, my little one. It'll be just fine. Your bruise will Surprised break. more people didn't tell Alex and what happened to his father. Didn't break. You know, but there's no sense in sugarcoating it. Down, like the uh, to hand Randall over to Norma. Down, deeper down, I don't know if that means like we didn't hand him over because we had already tree. killed him or what. I shiver cause I'm cold, but you don't want Well, yeah, I mean, most of the episode threes I've played so far, in fact, most of the games I've played so far from Telltale, most of the episodes run about two hours, except for Guardians of the Galaxy, which went about an hour and a half apiece. But this particular one, Episode one was an hour and a half, and two was like an hour and 20 minutes, and this was like less than an hour and 15 minutes. So it's really kind of disappointing. This really should have just been two episodes. Uh, did I put Norma out of her misery? Slightly more than half? Let Norma get killed by walkers? No way in hell was I putting her out of her misery. Not after what she'd put me through. Uh, and the vast majority of people chose to leave my daughters. Or leave their daughters. Or leave our daughters. I don't know how you would say that. But uh, I'd kind of like to know what would happen if we had stayed. That would be interesting to see how that played out. Popping music there, so it's not just silence. Any chance the stats will come up? I think these are bugged, and they won't actually come up. It's supposed to automatically do it if you have the cloud save enabled, but, and I know sometimes uh, in the first episode it won't. It hasn't had time to update, but I mean, this is, it's been like three weeks since I played the first one. And I've double checked everything, and it's not doing it. So, uh, even though all the other games I've played so far come up, so I think there's just something bugged about it. So, what can you do? Yes, indeed I can. That is quite interesting. And will this take forever to load? Give one more try after it does its update here. And 
even when it is working, you have to do it twice, but nope, it's still not going to work. Alright, we're just going to have to chalk up the shown stats as a lost cause. And I hate to have the short stream like this because I like to play for two hours ish. But what can you do? I don't have the next game in the series downloaded, so I can't really start on it, and it would probably run two hours of that. Um, so, what I got on Friday night is going to be uh, Friday night Fortnite, most likely Save the World. Uh, Monday night, I haven't decided on a game yet. There's a distinct possibility I won't stream Monday night. Uh, it depends on uh, if whatever else I've got going gets done in time. So Twitter will be the thing to look out for there. Uh, at this point, it's like a toss-up whether or not I'll be done in time. Uh, and then next Wednesday night, I'm going to start on uh, what's called Walking Dead, A New Frontier, which is uh, basically season three of the main Walking Dead storyline. So I can get all of those episodes in, crammed in just in time for the release of the uh, first part of the final season. So anyway, that's going to do it for me tonight. Uh, thank you again, Nia, for the bits. And I will see you next time.